Today, today is a big day, particularly on the Franklins, because we're uh, we got a pour on Thursday. Uh, gum up. We got to finish. It's complicated. We got steps and slopes and different levels of cement, and it's a small garage, but it's very very complex. So we're going to be on that. Over here, we got Joe and maybe another guy going to be putting in can lights. We definitely need the uh, framers here because we got a section of roof that still needs to be OSB, and the roofers can finish their uh, their dry in and uh, get started on that. So, you know, right here we need uh, we need our subs. Over there, we're going to have our full crew uh, busting out those forms. So that's the deal of a day. I can't imagine me losing a set between here and there, but I did. Well, the first floor. Yeah. So they has got to do all of that section, and then under the roof they can do that because it's got a ceiling, you yeah. know, that slatted roof. Yeah. So. Yeah. Then just take a look at it, see how it like, see how it attaches to the beams or whatever. Uh -huh. um, figure out where they're gonna go, uh -huh. and then uh, you know, size wise and everything. Yeah. And then maybe. Yeah. yeah and then just mark it. where they're gonna that, go. That 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 makes sense. Yeah. They, they, the whole deal is of putting it for venting, you know, for the for the uh, <clears throat> AC. Yeah. But he was talking about, Doug was talking about on this side coming in under the stairs yeah, or something. Yeah. So I don't know. Mm -hmm. That one we may have to wait. But it's okay. just a few lights. Okay. I know yeah. some clamps and. Uh, hey, I, I've got a, a bucket of clamps. A bucket of clamps. I ain't okay. kidding you. Yeah, Mike, that's, dude. That's, I mean, it's that's exactly what I need is a bucket of clamps. All right. a hard day at your property the other day, huh? Yeah, um, Martin called me this morning. Apparently we got a little leak over here on the other side I gotta look at. Oh. So trading days are on. It started right up the hill, Michael, when we traded it, when we got that real good buy on some flooring, uh, lots of nailers and a coist and everything else. Got me in the mood. Uh, what could I do for y'all to make sure we get this hit today? You got lumber, nail, I mean, anything you might need, let's make sure we got it so we don't stop. Some more two by fours. Alright. Hey, hey, is that a little, uh, Robert? Yeah. How many, how many two before? Are you just for bracing or do you need it for structural work? Both. So you need long ones? Yeah, we can bring them. Uh, I don't think anything's on that trailer. I don't know how many do you need, Dick? Some long ones. If you want to bring some long ones. Uh, do you need this anytime soon or just bring it back when I come? When I come. On the spot cooking. But you can get her in the middle of my friend. Look at that big ass fucking beat. Oh my god. The murder hornet. Holy shit, kill you. <laughs> it's gonna murder you. Oh boy. What, this? Is. No, this in stays here. Yeah. We're just gonna take it and do this. Okay. I think that I think that'd be okay. Yeah, we'll that one too.
poquito me raspado. Ya. ¿Quieres que quite este poquito, no? Poquito. Eso es un barranquito, así que no. No debe estar. Mucho tiempo. These are, these are the best workers, man. Telling you. They're the, the backbone of this company. So, yeah, I can't have it over here yet. We still gotta add uh, the 2x4 here for, for, for on that side for the stem walls. Okay. And then uh, when Doug comes tomorrow, he wants to help us put the outer, the inner stem wall. You know? All right, and then what, what's up with the steps? Right here. You got them done. They're done. Oh, hell yeah. Cool, man. Yeah, all we do is just run a rebar. Yeah. Simple as that, yeah, right? And then uh, we just got to do some more bracing, you know what I mean? Oh, okay, yeah, I see what you're saying. Yeah. Dude, done deal. Now, what I'm trying to understand is, is there going to be a double cage here? Because look how much concrete. Uh, yeah, there probably should be. Okay. Yeah. This is should yeah, well, we were supposed to build this up with more base and compact it more, but oh. since we don't, they, yeah, that's what I was, you yeah. know, wondering about if we were going to do the batter board or so we, we could get it. sandbags or... No, but sandbags. Have no, what no have more no sandbags. Yeah, no, maybe we'll, yeah, we'll talk to Doug, but yeah, that makes sense. We'll just double tie it. We'll do a double cage just we're, right here. We're going to help. Well, yeah, there should be way more base. They should have yeah. filled it up more, yeah. But, oh, okay. yeah, it is what it is. Boom said yesterday we got to put it, that it needs a little trench right there. Yeah, okay, done deal. So we're going to do all this shit. Um, what are we doing for the beans, fives? Mm. Yeah, we have fives. Okay. So, uh, I, I can start yeah, you can throwing the dials the and, and dragging fives yeah. out. So, yeah. let me measure how yeah. high do we want to. About a foot in the ground. A foot in the ground. Yeah. See that line? So, so yeah, five foot. On, on any that line right there. On any yeah. there. Oh, uh, no, I'm talking about for the dials running up. Oh, the dials? Uh, yeah, so yeah. we can knock them in and then tie the beams, or how do you want to do it? Yeah, just knock, knock two there, right? Yeah, but five foot for the dowels, because we're four feet to the line. Yeah, I guess we're on five. Yeah. So foot in, okay. maybe a little under. Right there, four feet, that's perfect. Yeah, but we're going to knock them in the ground, too. Yes. So So you want them at least four feet. Pick up. Oh, gosh. Gotcha. Because okay. so remember, the, and then we have the little stem wall right here. And then how, where's the where's the other cage going to be at? It's where's just it's just the, the, the stem wall is only three and a half. <laughs> oh, gotcha. So it's a little stem wall, you know what I mean? Okay. But we're gonna wait for Doug on this, and that is for the, I guess for the, so the one you're laying down. For the rock. The rock so we're gonna have a step down here or something? No, no, this is all one solid one slab, solid slab. and then it comes all the way back here level like this. Okay. So, gotcha. So what is this? This is like the is this? storage. But this and right here is this like a little back patio thing yeah. here? Yeah. That connects to all that. I see. Okay. Yeah, the step. Uh, just doesn't. It doesn't look like I know what I'm talking right about. I'm just this, this getting the fill right in. Okay. That's your sidewalk right there. Okay. I need to look at the plan. Hey, El Burro. Hey. El Burro. <laughs>
Um, I just have to put the boards around. Um, I started on it yesterday, but check all the heights because I didn't have this yet. Uh, they were using it at the other site, so I'm gonna check all my all my heights, make sure it's all level, which it's not. I just have to figure out how to make up the difference. And this is a good starting point. Make it till you make it. That's right. Okay. Making the uh, stem walls over at the Franklin's. Just got to raise it up, meet the foundation. It's a mix over there. Uh, I didn't go I forgot to put on my safety goggles. Do you see this? You can't beat me! You can't stop me!
Devin? Beautiful. Beautiful. That's all we need. Just to let you know, I could do it. Oh, yeah, I got you. Yeah, rebar's gonna run this way. Our grid's gonna run circle this way, and then it's gonna come this way. We put these dowels in here. We draw it up, uh, downwards this way, and then we put our dowels in there. That and then we push this down that way. The dowel it won't push out. You know, if the, if the slab air wants to move, these dowels are actually in there. So. Michael, got my plumbing hat on today. Yeah. This is always a deal. When you go get your can of glue, always get your pliers. Cause they're probably way away from where you're all set up to do your plumbing and these things hardly ever open without pliers. We're gonna see. <laughs> Looked out. The leak we had was over there and we fixed that now we're going to extend this porch we're going to have a laundry area extension so we'll bring it out so we're bringing all the water pipes out past the cement so that you know you can get to this as you know if it breaks or whatever so anyhow that's what we're up to today Light or just so bingo. So um, all the bathrooms, um, all the bedrooms, and all the bathrooms. Um, my husband's got a shower here. Okay, and talking to my wife, she doesn't want the switches near the showers. Now this one's unique because there's a door right here. Um, get it? How big is gonna be your, your trimmer here? So this is a misplaced, right? Because I, I did that. Yeah, we can put our two by four and then. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Add it. Just, just to. They can have space between your plate, my plate and the trainer. Right. So, so right here we've got a vanity, right? Vanity sink. Yep. So I need to add the plug, plug right here. But that'll be a GFI because of the sink, sink full right here. Mm -hmm. So we're going to tie it all in. But and that's the stuff I'm going to be working on here soon. But the three gang will have light, fan, and shower. So it'll be it'll be lights, fan, shower. So it'll be one one light in here, yeah. which the guys haven't done yet. You know, lights in here, and then um, the fan switch. Okay, uh, you're gonna have only one toilet? Just one toilet. Yeah, I know, right? Just just one toilet. We'll put it on, on top of here. Because I see yeah. the other pipe right here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that one is actually a clean out. It just okay. clean, it's, a, it's a clean out that will go this way. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, uh, this room is a little, this is the only room with the exposed beams that we're gonna cover up. Okay. Mm -hmm. And actually, there's gonna be, um, the same thing like the mm -hmm. over there. There's actually going to be a drop down box right here. We're going to be putting a uh, an AC duct. Oh, here. so they're going to fur it out. Mm -hmm. So it's going to be furred out a box here. The AC duct's going to run through here, and if you want to, you can run your wire. Yeah, we can use. You can just run the wire right along here. Yeah, we just take with them. Yeah. Oh, the tape will give us tape or no? Oh, I, I got some. Um, I got some for I, today. I got. I got okay. Some. Yeah. If I don't, I don't misunderstand. It's a three game. Do you want to turn it on and off from here and there? Right? Yeah. And, and then you'll be able to turn it on and off from both sides, right? Correct. Over there the lights, and here. The fan mm -hmm. and those lights in the middle. Correct. Okay. So this is the only bathroom with a, with a double door. And they will all have shower light, main light, fan light. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. 
He's got the electricians over there. Yeah. So he's kind of, but the fact that he didn't have anything negative to say is good. Here's your first step. Right. It comes this on out. Good. Okay. Yeah. yeah, first step, and the rock lug is sitting on that step, and the beam sits in. So we're sitting in five and a half plus three and a half, so eight, nine. It's nine inches off that step in. Is that right? Not the top. Not the top step. Uh, That's the top step. Is That's top step. Step right here, mm -hmm. top foundation. Okay, it kind of pops in. It's really three and a half in. I think we're yeah. There. yeah, you're there. Yeah, you're exactly there. Yeah. Okay. As long as you're straight on the step. Okay. Okay. So. Viene que ando la línea con este cuando pongamos el tag más o menos. ¿Verdad? I like when the boss is here, get, we get clarity here. Brown nosing will work, Robert. Huh? Around two by four. Let me clean my nose. Yeah. <laughs> you already got a brown nose. We ran a two by four on this side of it, concrete on this side. Here, here. Gotta roll out the leads. She's gonna blow. We got all four corners set up. We were supposed to do this about a week ago. <laughs> the concrete is gonna come up to here, Robert. And then it's gonna drop down. This is your new level. Like it'll be sitting here like this. Yeah. And then we're going to put a 2x4 on top of it like that, and then one offset of it like this, right. and we'll nail into there. Okay. Got it? I got you. So, all this comes out, you know, we'll strip that. Okay. just take it out. All right. And then right here, I don't know what you got to do to hold this thing up. Uh, no, it's already nailed. Okay. That, that, you mean the, the backboard right there? Yeah. Well, I'm going to, you want me to leave, we're going to leave this here still. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So let's just take this out right now. Yeah. And then save this one, because you'll be putting it back. Hey, Doug. Okay. No, no, en el plano ahí dice que se mete, que se necesita mi Sí, pero eso va a Start screwing that in. Well, we get to cut them. Well, do you want to just cut it up there? Mm -hmm. Oh, no, no. Let's cut it on the ground. Okay. All right. I, we can take. Screw, boy. I can calculate exactly what. That's how it's done. Hey, wait, wait, wait. See the elders? That's see the exactly tool belt? That's what I'm talking about. You see He's the tool belt? Like you see the <laughs> extra large tool belt? Big Mike's not here today. Thanks, Big Mike. I look way better in it. I want to hear about yeah, this boy bullshit. Oh. Quiero el nivel de ese. El, el concrete. Pon esta, pon esta aquí. Okay, let's go. Esta blanca. La marca blanca. Tengo un clavo, ¿no? I see a mark right here. I'm assuming that's it. I don't know. We'll check this. No, can we move? Can we move that. My, my, my level. Right there. Right there. 
Yeah. And then what we'll do, yeah. So, so right. Wow, well, go to the bottom, go underneath it. Oh, shit. Sure. All right, we're going to have two. So now, now we we'll have to cut it. So, technically, it's lining up with this, right? Yeah. It sits right on there, so all we got to do is trim it up. Yeah. Mark it right there where I have to cut it. You want a little tight or? Oh, hold on, hold on. Right. Pablo, is it tight? That's pretty, I thought myself. Okay. Right. Maybe a little bit, a little bit more. Well, we're gonna have to, uh, a little more that way we can, let's see. Yeah, cause. Well, let's see, uh, this is gonna come in here. Yeah. And I guess, we'll, okay, so that's good. So what we'll do is the concrete will flow through here yeah. and then we'll have, to, we'll have to take this out. Once things start setting up, we'll knock it out. Okay, yeah, we'll make, okay, not right now. Not, that's no, good. no, no, oh, no. Yeah. Like, yeah, generally, but I gotta, I gotta watch my... From the bottom. Watch your, dot your eyes and <laughs> cross your T's. I gotta watch the magic hands with Robert swinging the hammer. Oh, that's it. Yeah, we need the hands. You got the magic hands. Alright. You gotta shake and okay. bake. It's, no. it's there for now. No. So the driveway is going to be up, it's going to be right here. This is high. Well, maybe it's all right. So the drive with the concrete, when we pour it, it's going to be right up here. Okay. Oh, so your rock lug might be. So the concrete's this high, right? Yeah. It'll be tied into the driveway, which is a nice little slope over the driveway, which looks really good. So the concrete's that high. Rock lug is that high. So the rock lug is running along here. But as we get higher and higher, the rock lug's going to step down. Yeah. But we're going to have a pretty good exposed foundation along here. Yeah. So what, do you want to do the rock lug on the outside or something? Or well, to do that, we have to move the entire wall. Yeah. You hear me out. So we Maybe cut this. Let's do it. We <laughs> cut this right here, I'll just say. Okay. We get the saw. We cut, we cut this off. We cut this off. We cut this out. When we, we, we pour the concrete, it'll be this high. Yeah. So what, two feet? Now it's only going to be exposed 14 inches. Well, look at that one over there. Yeah, yeah, I got it. Hey, what up? No, you're right. But see, that's what we'll end up doing. Because when we put the concrete drive in here, we we'll fill this out. It'll be that's all the way here on the property line. Yeah, you'll see a little bit of a. Yeah, you'll have. A you're gonna see. So you're only coming up six inches. Well, we can cheat just a little bit. Up there. I'm trying to make it look as nice as we can, but the complexity of building this down into the foundation is. Yeah, it'd be a whole other story. Yeah. All right. Well, let's just. I think a good way is. We're not all blessed with long. Uh, what do we <laughs> call these appendages? Yeah. You, you, what we're gonna do it? Well, once once you see it, it'll make sense. Uh huh. I, mean, I ain't got a problem. Well, yeah, we're on the rebar. I, I see it. We might need a little trim piece. That's okay. So if you want to run that rebar, but see your board wise. We got everything else finished. Once we once we run this little piece here, we gotta trim that.
Uh, you gonna, are you going to pour it fast or are you going to do little sections? Well, I want to do that section first right there, you know what I mean? Yeah. Oh, uh, so we'll start at the end and then we'll see where it, uh, it bends this way. Yeah. Well, uh, stop right there, that way we get that nice and neat, you know what I mean? Oh, okay. And so, then, you, so you can go, what you can do is you can pour that section, yeah. then pour that section, then this section, let yeah. it set up a little bit, yeah. and maybe kind of get it trialed out. That way I get then... in there, that way I can, uh, cause, uh, okay. to do the, uh, the edging, yeah. it's going to be a bitch out there. Bags up there. Open them up. And each one of the uh, legs sticking out. They're, they're plastic chairs to put underneath. The chair. I got 60 of them, so about 30 halfway through. Stop it. Now it's just water came out. I know first hand with Hey, let's connect. That was black. Okay. All right, bring it back. Straight it back this way so we don't have to fucking the free fall. That's all you got. Well, to be honest. All right, hold on, hold on. All right, let's go. Come on, baby. Get this
grab it from this, from this top. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hey, who's, so, who's the strong one here? You alright? Uh, yeah. Alright, I'm ready now. We <laughs> <laughs> have fire, fire, but holding nothing. up fire hose. <laughs> Yeah. You know what? I appreciate it. Uh -huh. Stay Edge uh, where's my paddle at? Right here. Oh, we got a real paddle. See y'all later. I'm going to the island. Yeah, that's our water bug right there. Yesterday, three different idols went in the water. Each end got it. The last item was my cell phone. Bloop, right at dark. He dove in, came up. It was still on. We got it off, but it's fried. It's done. I'll come up here, don't toss it. <laughs> don't toss it, please. Well, I mean, I can toss it close enough to where he could get it before it sinks. I got it. Don't you dare step in the concrete. Don't you dare do that. Don't you do that, Joseph. Oh! There you go. Leaves his boots on and everything. He doesn't care. It's going to be a long day for the amphibian. Yeah, You need somebody to bolt float it! No, we're still good, it's still wet. I don't want any concrete burns. Probably need a long one. Yeah. Yeah. Two. Maybe two. Go on, go on. Okay. Watch this fourth, Mike. Well, I think he's fine. I hope they're going to get this. They're beating on the damn hose. They can't get the shit unstuck.
yourself? Do you think maybe Cody Graham? You don't want to go that way because the clams that are in there. So we'll cut your Okay, so where do you want me to go? on that right there I need this little corner we gotta get a pipe through here got it Yeah, you don't, don't let it get so high. Can we get some people with come alongs right there? If I get to tie this thing up, then you can stand up. Like yeah. a little, little birdie on here. Push that wall back, you know? Good. work out here.
go. Get over there and show them to me over here. Yes, sir. That side up uh, underneath the, 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 the chute. Yeah, we we'll just take two legs Put underneath here? the side. Yeah. With both two by sixes up. Who needs the wire? Yeah, see? Exactly. Put the fuck up and I'd go with that. If you're talking about my question, you hear crap. Well, see, you get it. I'm dying, man. We're ready yet! Uh, be safe this weekend, Texas Crew Dogs.